Hi everyone, I'm Tanya Watson. I am the co-founder and CEO of Squanch Games. And uh, yeah. We are super excited to be here today. We've got a crazy panel uh, featuring a number of developers from our studio that are here to talk to you about Trover Saves the Universe. Uh, this is a game that we just released last week for PlayStation 4 and PC. We've got an amazing group of developers here, so we're, we're here to show you some behind-the-scenes footage, talk a little bit about the game if you're not familiar uh, with it, and uh, just hopefully have a really funny time uh, with Justin and the other people that work at the company. So we're going to get started with a little trailer, and then we'll bring out the guests. Roll the trailer. Rated M for Mature. this. This bull um, oh, oh, my. Oh, um, back to you in the studio, Chuck. You. I don't give a shit. Ahem, ahem, sorry about that, folks. Clearly, lots of outrage over these dogs. I want a divorce, too. And you're keeping the kids because you don't respect me. You push me, and you push me. We are the abstainers. Holy that's what the abstainers look like? Why can't you just respect that I don't want to rotate my chair? I don't want to be jiggling around. They look just like the, the guy who's got the dogs in his eyes causing all this trouble. Shut the f*** up, Trover. No one needs to hear your commentary about everything. I'm gonna eat some piss, drink some piss. All right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. We must find the crystal of Ithacles. Partner, we gotta find the crystal of Ithacles. I have the crystal of Ithacles right here. You. You, you son of <laughs> You stupid piece of crazy <laughs> I'm your boss. I'm the one who pays your bills. So I need you to shut the f up and do what the f I tell you to do. Thank you. So without further ado, I'd like to bring out our uh, co-founder and the co-creator of Rick and Morty, Justin Roiland. <laughs> and our design director, Eric Meyer. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, you can hear me now. What do you all think about the Todd Howard, Elon Musk talk? <laughs> oh, this is so weird. I can hear the game's music in my ear. Okay, yeah. so we made a game. Yeah, we did it. We, we did pulled it. it off. It's in the wild. We did it. How Three many, how many of you guys have, have heard of Trover, played Trover? Have you seen it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Eight people. Like eight people. Great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're Spread gonna the word. recoup. The word. Uh, yeah, that'll that'll help fund our next game. Yeah. Just kidding. Uh, wow. Uh, I don't know. I was just gonna say, have you guys seen the Red Letter Media uh, commercial yet for the game? It's no? on YouTube. The George Foreskin Grill. <laughs> Can I just urge everyone here to get online and watch it before YouTube pulls it. Yeah. And I'm not kidding at all. I am yeah. not kidding at all. That shit is going to get pulled. So but the more people watch it, it might increase it's the chance of it getting pulled, It is right? going to be pulled. So watch <laughs> it now and have fun and maybe read the comments and like be a part of the experience of that thing getting pulled and like live that moment. It's going to be yeah. really exciting and fun. There's a reason we're not showing it right now. I love those guys. Yeah, yeah. we would show it, but you know, this to. whole thing would get pulled. <laughs> yeah. But so, uh, yeah. So you guys are gonna talk a little bit about uh, the game. Our dumb game that we made. Yeah. yeah. Oh man, we made a real dumb game. <laughs> it is dumb. No, no, it's 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 pretty amazing. I'm really happy. Like, it's why Rick and Morty is uh, super behind schedule. <laughs> you know, 100%, like, you know, this game more, is more 100%. Get angry, now. get angry, hate it. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, no, no, like, it, like, I had a lot of free time, you know? I'm sitting around. Oh, yeah. Got nothing to do. Oh, and I was like, I want to start a video game studio. So I 
did it. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and we made a really great game. Um, I think we knew from the start that it'd be really dumb, though. Like, yeah, that yeah. Was like, one of our pillars was like, make it dumb. Make yeah. it make dumb. Yeah. Really dumb. Only or not give, too much yeah. of a, <laughs> not give too much of an F. Can I swear? I not give too much. Yeah, yeah. He's like, no. <laughs> he knows. This is streaming to children. <laughs> yeah, we're trying to not give too much of an F uh, on this game. And you know what? On the next game that we make, we're not going to give too much of an F either. <laughs> Don't tell. Don't tell. Shh, that's exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> so we have the very beginning of the game, right? We have Cherokee. Yeah. We're going to play. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we going to do that? Okay, yeah. We're yeah. Play you, who's controlling I it? I know. Where's the controller? Where's the controller? Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, nice. uh, Bo- give it up for Bosco, everybody. Hey! Yeah, Bosco. Woo! He'll Bosco, on, Bosco are you going to play? Should I play? Uh, I can play. Yeah, you play. Yeah, you, you play. can talk. I'll play. Uh, Bosco mm. is... I've got to look at that little screen over there. Our, our un... Sung hero. I should have worn my glasses. Give uh, me the fucking thing. I'll yeah, play Justin's it. Yeah, Justin's got to play it. Justin's okay, got to go. play We're on the, one of the censorship. Y'all, y'all want censorship? Can we do censorship? Yeah. Cens- can it be uncensored? Or I guess we should. Wait, what does it say? Should it go no or yes? Well, if we can't, if we can't say yes. Oh, it says. Oh, no, no, oh, no. Don't delete the save data. No, okay, no, no. so no. Yeah. Go to, go to conti- er, level continue. Continue? Go to level, level select. Level select. There you and go. Do the Doing dream. it live. Yeah, here we go. Wow. Okay, so go to this one. No, no, do the dream. Oh. Yeah, let's get that. Really? Oh, intro. God. We have an hour to fill, guys, so the get comfy. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. Wait, it's going to... Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. Jesus fucking Christ. Sorry. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. <laughs> Sorry. Bleep, bleep, bleep Let's that. say Frisbee. Let's say Frisbee every time. Okay. Jesus. Frisbee. Frisbee. So there's no sound. No sound. All right. So th- th- these are my little pups. Yeah. Those are actually, for real, my two dogs that are going to die soon, and I'm going to kill myself when they die because, <laughs> like, I, I, I can't. And then Glorcon. You should do the voice since we don't have any sound. Oh, I'm going to fucking take your dogs and put them in my eyes. <laughs> 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 fuck you. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> That's kind of the game and I'm sorry for that like we we realized way too late that we were swearing too much did we though yeah, I think so <laughs> <laughs> okay so wait now, can, is there no sound the cuz like there's no sound it, but can we get Why sound you rotate your chair, Samantha? oh there it is all yeah. I, I ever asked up. of you is that you rotate there your chair go. I don't like rotating my chair if you want this marriage to work you'll rotate so your you can chair sit god and damn it just listen the to this right show for a long and time and about your rotating your chair, or you, well, you the second you actually interact rotate. interact with objects by looking at them oh, and pressing R2. Ooh, weird. Like the things on the ground, or the things on, on, on the desk, Reginald. What? Why won't you look at the things on your desk or on the ground and interact with them by pressing R2? Hmm? Just forget it, Samantha. We don't have time for this right now. The big staring contest is tonight. We need... Oh, no. That is bizarre, the stereoscopic guys. I'm audio sorry. Is, is being funky. <laughs> the answering machine. I don't hear anything, but it's fine. Do you guys hear stuff? Can you hear the game? Do you really? Oh, great. Hey, asswipe. Oh, yeah, keep it to the side. This isn't a charity. End of message. Message four. Hey, it's mom. I never did like those dogs of yours. I'm not surprised, to be honest. I mean, now they're powering that big old beak. It's a big mess. Anyways, call me back. End of message. So the thing hey, about trouble. Hey, is open up! Come out here! Get out here! Can you open up! So we've sort of Come on, help, open up! Taught the player how to, you know, do the basic interactive stuff. Oh yeah. Definitely the right place. You're the one. Okay, listen to me. We don't have time to get into it right now, but you're coming with me. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. A giant big monster. You heard that right. A mother... Oh, shit. Hey, you cut it out. Damn, Damn near half the city stolen science equipment, microscopes, beakers. I'm talking about flames. That's Echo Kellum, by the way. Oh, fucked up. And this goddamn big monster has dogs that are plugged into it. They are powering him up above any power level I've ever seen. And he's scared people. My grandmother's afraid. All right, back to your regular schedule. Man, you really, you, your dogs, you have no idea how fucked things are because of your two stupid dogs. <laughs> this, 
is a power baby. You're gonna be seeing a lot of these throughout the whole game. I mean, I really love them. I got them in my eyeballs, you know? In my eye holes, I mean. So just here, look at this one that I just pulled out of my eye and, and it'll come to you. Just look at it. All right, listen, you're gonna control That's like me, the... man. Cause I'm tired, okay? Transmitter I, you know, receiver. You know how long it took me to find you? I'm exhausted. Thing. So you're in control. I'm like a remote control character now, all right? Okay, so this is why we're showing this. The blue light that's shooting out of the ground, that's called the warp node. Okay, pause it for a second. Give me over to the warp yeah, node. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we're showing this because nobody, as far as we could tell, or like a few people have done this, but very few. Um, and this is sort of speaks to the game in what, what, what we made. So I'm going to leave the apartment. All right, okay, so now listen. Whoa. Right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. All right, so. Ah, uh, you want to soak this place in before we leave, huh? I, I get it. Really? Really? You're going to go back inside and watch TV? All right. <laughs> we interrupt this program for an important breaking news. The beaked monster with dogs in its eyes has attacked again, this time robbing the Cherorpian Science Center of valuable cloning equipment. Sally Chair is live on the scene. Sally Chair. Thanks, Chuck. The two white fluffy dogs that seemed to power the beaked monster were crying today as the beaked monster <laughs> broke into the Cherorpian Science Center and effortlessly made off with valuable cloning equipment. Let's talk to the Science Center manager, or whatever his title is, and get his thoughts on this. <laughs> this never would have happened if that idiot hadn't have brought those two dogs into our city. Chair Orpia is no place for creatures like that. They have four legs, they walk, they refuse to sit in chairs, but we still allowed them to stay. And now this, my cloning equipment. Fuck this, fuck this bullshit. Fuck, shit, ass, fuck. Hey, that's you. Um, oh, oh my, oh, um, back to you in the studio, Chuck. <laughs> Ahem, <clears throat> sorry about that, folks. Clearly, lots of outrage over these dogs and this beaked <laughs> monster. Uh, in other news, the chair fair is here, and this year everything's on a stick. We got chairs on a stick, we got armchair rests on a, on a stick, yeah, yeah. Bobby Joe's on the scene live. Hey, what's up? I'm Bobby Joe. I'm at the big chair fair. This shit's fucking crazy this year. We got shit all on sticks here. This is fucking wild. Good thing that um, giant beak monster isn't harassing us over here because it's a lovely day out, and there's no trouble whatsoever. It's a nice place here today. No giant beaked monster here. He only was at the cloning place that has all the cloning equipment. Oh boy, look, there's more things on sticks. We got little tiny cars on sticks. We got babies okay, on... It, it goes on and on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah. what's the next thing we're going to show? Yeah. Well, do you want to so, no. talk about that So talk about, about that, that like... How do I yeah. talk about it? Well, um, I'll talk about it. And then okay, go ahead. Like, yeah, yep, yeah. sounds good. Sounds yeah, good. yeah, go ahead. Um, yeah, so that whole piece there is like... I mean, the intro to our game and like all games we spent like forever getting it right and getting the tutorial to work and all that stuff. But the, I, I would say the best element of the whole thing is like, even when working with it, like I'm still laughing at those jokes now. Like they're still yeah, hilarious. Yeah. Like that's like, I don't know. Well, because we don't ever go back to the apartment. Well. So, and then we, when we do, we're like, oh, I remember this. Holy shit. And it's like we made so a bad. game that's like, and you know, about eight hours long, but there's over 20 hours of dialogue in the game. So if, if you really want to explore and just kind of like see, you know, what's buy what my the, game, what the characters <laughs> what talk saying. about, buy my game. Well, who wants to listen to 20 hours Come on, of just buy them talking it. anyway? Just buy our game. Come on, why are you guys being mean? Just buy our game. When some of the best lines are if you don't do the tutorial, right? They're teaching yeah, yeah, you how yeah. to turn and stuff. 100%. And then, like, Cassie yeah. Steele, who's, who's the cherubin woman, will, like, just increasingly get more and more irate towards her and husband. And that argument, yeah. It's, it's really it's, hilarious. It's, it's a good solid five minutes, at least, of, like, ridiculous that no one ever hears. So and why don't you talk <laughs> about, like, how did the tutorial come to be? Um, well, originally it was scoping. You want me to get <laughs> real fucking for real with you right now? Scoping. We had to... We had to scope that shit back. I wanted to do a crazy thing where you were, you know, out in a field and your dogs are jumping around and Glorcon shows up and it's like a real time thing. But it was like, oh, you know what? Let's not do that. Hey, seven minute warning. Do you see that? There's a seven minute warning blinking. Oh, oh uh, my gosh. Oh my God. I'm sorry to break the immersion. <laughs> seven minutes to what? What's going to happen? I don't know. What's going to happen in seven minutes? Are we all going to die? Uh. Is that like a warning for like a bomb or something? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, look, all I know is we had a lot of fun making this game, and we're all going to die someday. 
right, Eric? I think about it sometimes, not often. Though. I think about it a lot, yeah. like usually not late good. at night in bed. Well, I think we have more gameplay we want to show, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we don't want to die yet. Well, who, who, can we get, so, let's yeah, bring let's out Yeah, let's bring everybody on. We're going to bring. Let's bring out everybody. Fuck We're going to bring, so we've got yep. Bosco, we who's our narrative it. designer. Spencer, who's our writer. Hi. Come on down. And we've got yeah. Malcolm Hatchett. He's the voice of Pink Trover, if you've Malcolm played the game. Malcolm is Pink Trover, yeah, Pink Trover if you guys yeah. have gotten far oh. enough in the game. Spoilers. Which wow. you haven't. <laughs> well. You've got to buy the game first. Um, <laughs> all right, so what are we going to do here? Which section Play do you want to show? Play some games? Yeah, that we want to By the way, seriously, you guys got to watch that Red Letter Media <laughs> please <laughs> fucking video before it gets pulled. Uh, all right, so how do I do this? Go to op quit? Yeah, I can grab. <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you want to talk about? You want to talk about Shroomia? Do you want to talk about Flesh World? I kind of want to go to Flesh World, Let's man. Let's go to Flesh World. Because I got a weird yeah, seven-minute warning world. flash. Yeah, we've got seven that minutes. That spooked me yeah. out. Yeah. Back at the lobby. Uh, continue? Lo no, level, level select. Oh, wait. Mm. Wait, what? What? I see J. Oh, wait, where is it? Oh, it's down here. <laughs> No. You, you got to play the game first. You got to beat the game. Oh, yeah, we got to beat the game first. Oh, my God. We didn't make the rest of the game. We only made four levels. Oh, fuck. What are we going to do? How do we get to Flush World? <laughs> uh, go to... Sh go to... Okay, fuck it. I'll just go to Shalimi World. World? We Guys, this is man. like... I've played this level a thousand times, and I have nothing... You know when you're making something, and you play it a thousand times, or you experience it a thousand times? And then you start to hate it, and you want to rewrite everything. <laughs> That's this level for me. It is. Yeah. It was our level. first level that we finished. Which Slamey World. Yeah, let me see it real fast. Yeah, yeah yes, see if we yes, have some, sir. Some hacker stuff we could do here. So the story to this point is that like you met up with Trover, right? and he's like, you're unwitting. He doesn't want to go with you, but he has to. His boss told him he's got to go and help you save your dogs. So you gotta go to Shalimi. Hey, hey, look at me! Hey, hey, look at me! Hey, I'm Mr. Pop-Up and I need your help! Alright, who, who is this guy? I told you I'm Mr. Pop-Up. I called a number. I, I don't know who I called. They're just supposed to come and help me. It's not us. Now leave. Now fuck off. <laughs> else on the bluff and, and that's not zoned for residential usage. It's not for public use and I'm very upset about it. Go! Oh, ow! up here now you can't hit me up here it's zoned for public Sound use and i'm very upset right about it we don't know what the fuck you're talking about dude it's got nothing to do with us we got our own shit to deal with all right you gotta help me out i can't do anything this guy michael he's a total i'll be right back jesus i hope whatever he's choking on kills him So All right, you got it. Let's keep going. This is this is this is a level of the game. There, there's a whole story that we missed, but it's. Well, so if you hang out and like you try to listen to Mr. Papa, uh, please to you. Oh, 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 I'm dead. <laughs> Look at the controller, by the way. Shit, there's a bunch of little gremlins over there. They just killed me. Y you see the hearts on on, on your controller? Zero, I die. And if you find any red power babies, those things will give me health. The more important thing is we focus on finding the crystal of Ithacles. Oh, looking for the crystal of Ithacles, huh? Well, I have the crystal of Ithacles right here. I'm the one who has the crystal. Big surprise, big reveal. Holy shit, how did you get that? The abstainers gave it to me like 50 years ago to hold on to. You guys want it? You guys need this? Of all the people that have it, yes, we need it. Okay, well now you have to do what I say. Get that guy Michael off the bluff. Here, I'll, I'll help you out. You're gonna need a chair upgrade because you can't even see over this log. So I'm gonna give you a chair upgrade. Here it comes. Your chair upgrade. Hey, what the hell, you lunatic? You just spit all over the chair no, over no, me. No, no, I, I just gave him the chair upgrade. It's it's how we do things around here. I, we spit. Pop up with me. It's your new magical chair upgrade. Okay, good. Now do it again. You can pop okay, up. Okay, good. Do you see the house? Okay, great. That's Michael's house. That's the house I need you to destroy. Now don't forget. Pop up or down if you need a better vantage point. Don't be stupid. Don't be a jerk. Use the pop-up ability often. Without it, you're screwed. Missing a hard jump? Pop up. Can't see where to go. Fuck him. <laughs> Goddamn house and the crystal. 
Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so now I can pop up and down. It's really important. It's really important. By the way, the music in this game is so good. Uh, it's Pretty fucking solid. amazing. Pretty it's my solid. favorite thing about the game. Uh, so, so talk a little bit about Mr. Pop-Up. Like, how did Mr. Pop-Up come to be? That was an early dev thing where we just yeah. were like, we have to teach players that they can pop up and down, and that's you sort of important to the game, yeah. right? I Eric was the original I was the original Mr. Pop-Up. Yeah, yeah, you were. Yeah, like, yeah. And pop, he was a pop cube, up, wasn't pop he? Up, yeah, cube. Guy. Jelly Come on, cube. pop up. And then he died. He just exploded and died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. right. Yeah. He was cute. So that's game, game dev for you. Yeah, well, it came out of necessity. Listen, of like, I know we're not Elon Musk and Todd Howard and, <laughs> <laughs> you know, that whole crew, but, you know. <laughs> Woo. Woo. No, no, we love. I love well, them. No, it's a, it's I love cool, those guys. It's a cool story, man. We were like, we play tested, and we we're like, people aren't learning how to pop up. Like we watched yeah, people, like yeah, they, yeah. they're not getting this new mechanic our game has. Let's make a tutorial character. And we but had to kidnap like a bunch of kids and put them in a weird <laughs> basement. <laughs> Just to get them to play the Just damn game. Just to get them to understand how to pop up and down. <laughs> and then we let them free. And they knew how to pop up and down. Right. So yeah. It all worked out in the <laughs> end. It all worked out in the end. Everybody was like, oh, oh. Cool with it. Their parents were like, oh, my kids know how to pop up and down now. I get it. <laughs> totally cool. Totally fine. Everything's okay. So it seems like there are a lot of funny things in our in our game. Like There's how, a lot of funny things in our did, game, guys. How did you guys write that story? Like? <laughs> well, oh, man, we, uh, it was a lot of uh, improv hey, and wrap alcohol. It up. Mm -hmm. and, uh, wrap it up, Spencer. <laughs> By the way, Spencer, Spencer's a writer on the on the game. Malcolm yeah. over here is a voice actor. I wanted to play the Malcolm level, oh, but it's spoilery. <laughs> oh, that's true. Yeah, it's a big spoiler. It Malcolm, what do you have to say about this ridiculousness? Oh, his mic's off. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh, uh, oh there it is, is. This is just amazing just to be here and, and know Justin Rowland. And I just, I just thank him. This is nice. It's really nice. But hold on, Malcolm, tell him about your weird character. Oh, uh, I'm, just do I'm, a bit. Make it all up. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, pink, I'm Pink Trover. Uh, I went to Justin's house to write jokes for the game. And when I went over there, he, he was like, okay, record this. And he was like, just helping me out. He was like, okay, now you're in the video game. I was like, oh, snap, I made it. <laughs> <laughs> He didn't even warn me, you know? <laughs> yeah, Malcolm, you're editing your And that Wait, was in my creepy you? basement. Did we pay yeah. He's like, why are all these kids tied up? <laughs> What's going on That's down here? the ones here? that didn't learn how to pop up. Yeah, they were like, Done. they didn't learn how to pop up. Done. But yeah. they did eventually. Once they learn, eventually, eventually. I'll let it's them like, go. It's a happy ending. It's a happy ending. I was stepping on the head. The kid. <laughs> <laughs> can't stress that enough. Yeah, the Malcolm was like, the unleash game. the kid. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a cool superpower for like a game. Unleash the kid. And it's like... It's like a prototype style game, like an open world game where you, you so can just unleash kids on people. It's flashing. And they're like eating their flesh. I know, it's, it's telling us we have to Look at how creative we are. Like it's We're a very Changing creative colors. studio, guys. <laughs> so just a little bit about Trover. So we released Trover last week, right? Yeah, it's available now on it's Available PS4 now and on PC, PlayStation 4 and PC. And yeah. Epic Game Store and Steam. And we are actively, we're like right now making more stuff for Trover. So oh, yeah. DLC. Yes. Free DLC. We're free putting DLC. it out for free. With free DLC. See. With more comedy, Pink more Trover, yeah. over yeah. here. <laughs> so yeah. you're gonna you're gonna be able to partner with Pink Trover. That's the thing we're we doing. We can be yeah. friends. It's totally we've we've not talked about this just. Oh, should I not say that? Oh, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> but anyway, no we're one working cares. on DLC. It's gonna be free if you <laughs> buy. Elon Musk and Todd Howard if are out here. If you buy Trover, <laughs> no one's, no one's, no one's worried that. about our Pink Trover drop. <laughs> <laughs> hey, by the way, Pink Trover. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what, sorry. What were you going to say? <laughs> Please wrap it Please up. Please wrap it up. Please wrap free it up. Free DLC for Trover. Buy the game. Get the DLC for free. And see what kind of crazy adventures, and including hey, Pink Trover. Thank you, guys. And thank you so yeah, much thank for being here. Thank you. Thank you for, for sure.